today I'm going to be trying to repair this A-frame cover. Now it looks like it's only held on with one screw, so it shouldn't be too difficult to remove and get it onto the workbench, see what we can do with it. I've got it on the desk, it was pretty easy and straightforward to get off. It was just one screw there holding it in, but there should be one on the other side, just there. As you can see, it's in quite a mess. So I'm gonna try and repair that, repair this crack here, and repair this side bit here. Anywhere where there's a crack, really. This plastic is made from something called ABS plastic. I haven't got a clue what that means, but I've done some research and that is what it's made of. Now, I can use an ABS uh, cement to glue this, which is what I'm gonna do. And all ABS cement is solvent cement that plumbers use. Now I've got loads of this hanging around, so I'm gonna put a blob of ABS cement just down there and, and see what happens. is drying so while that's off all I'm gonna do is give the grease nipples a quick clean up with just some degreaser and a cloth make sure they're all nice and clean and the nipples are working as they should be They're a lot cleaner now than they were before. Cleaning all the nipples, what I did, it, there's a little ball bearing there. I'll just press them down with something sharp and you can see some grease is coming out of there. If the grease is coming out, we know that the new grease will go in. Sometimes these little ball bearings there get stuck and it won't accept the grease. But if you just work on with a, a pin or the end of a screwdriver, then that will keep on in tip-top working order. Also as well, I've just took a minute and just to check the welds on either side. Make sure everything's okay there. So the glue's all dry now. That is pretty solid. I'm happy with that. I've also stuck a patch on the inside there just to reinforce this section as this was the worst section. I think there was a bit running down there cracked along here and I think there was also a crack just going up there as well so it's not it's not perfect but it does the job and all I used for this patch was a bit of PVC plumbers pipe cut a bit off 
uh, roughly the size I needed, cut a line down there, heated it up, flattened it out, let it go cool, and then once it was flat, I just reheated it up until it went all soft and floppy. I put it onto the affected area and just shaped it to the shape it needed to be. And that is on there pretty well. That There's no chance of that coming off. So it's all back together, screwed in both sides and now it's fine, no weakness there at all. A frame cover has been put back on now and both nipples are clean so that looks like another successful repair.